13, but what is it? Is it a Necro? Is it a Geist? It's a Necro. I'm extremely dubious of our archers ever killing anything. I think the fight is doable if we cheese the high ground. Cheese, if we take advantage of the high ground. And get our archers in range of the Necro, maybe. Let's go. We have one archer. He's pretty bad. So we might have to walk in on him. It's a lot of axes here. Oh, there's a fallen hero there. I didn't notice. Okay, that just made it a little bit scarier. Becomes important to kill the art, uh, the Necro. I don't know if we'll get there or not. It's actually whippable from that tile. I wonder if that's a thing. It's a lot of pressure on an early hybrid. He doesn't get to shoot through things. Yeah, about that. 15% you say. I think we're better off taking a hit squad. And oh, but I swapped out the fucking reach weapon. He's the third shield here, I think. So we're going to have to bring a hit squad to kill the Necro. We can't take this fight long term with the Necro. There's too many armored wider gangers with axes that will kill us eventually. I think this is going to be our hit squad leader. Still like three turns to get that way though. Whip over there, huh? Yep, that is the issue. Twenty eight percent with bullseye. Well, I guess. Okay. 
Where's the buff here? Is in reach. It's a very big deal. Yeah, let the zombies fill in over here. I want to take this guy's armor. Getting fallen here upgrades right now is a pretty big deal. I want to do damage there. I don't want him intercepting our hit squad. Not sure I can do that realistically right now, though. The whip is so good, chat. So good. <laughs> Thanks, uh, have a butt liquor. I'm glad you uh, enjoyed the video. What is my one commandment? I want to know what that is without clicking on it. Debated by a uh, chat solutions. Should go ahead of him. Debuff, no debuff, damn. This is gonna suck. Okay, only hit one, thankfully. I can get there. I don't have to get there. There instead. That zombie is not. Ah, oh shit. I messed up though. The zombie is not locked in defending him. It's actually a bit of an issue. gonna be buffing that shit over there all the time we need to get over here yeah I see that was a mistake kind of a big one too what happened to my guy Pretty sure he'll buff based on this. This is really annoying that I went after this guy attacked, but the turn before the Necromancer buffs. Give me a fucking break, friend. I see they fixed poison on the uh, the Ills Rock. I didn't, but that's hilarious and totally expected. 
I told you, chat. I apologize ahead of time for breaking all of the strats I beat him. So he still buffs it, even though it's disarmed. That's good. That means like if I can preemptively pick the most uh, dangerous one, I can uh, debuff. Getting a little low over here. Hit me three times, connected with all of them, and did real damage. It's unpleasant. If I go there, it should pull the zombie over. Although it might pull that one. Which one moves first? Damn. Stakes. Really? Oh, I don't have the stamina to disarm. Fuck. Yeah, we're getting a little low here. Sully may or may not die here. We really need this Necro down. Yeah, close to dying. All right. Yeah. Hit squad did its thing. Do you need a little bit of help over this way? Uh, yeah, Kevman Post cheating, of course. I mean, it's not Iron Man rolls. I mean, every roll rolls again just to make sure it hits. It's a mod I installed. It's called uh, the. Uh, the fairness mod allowing you to fairly engage the enemy in the way that they engage you. It's like uh, having Lucky on all your brothers except for offense. You guys don't play with that mod? I mean, it's not integrity mod improved, but what is? you not to die to a single zombie but I mean I guess stamina to disarm this guy <laughs> every time you attack with the whip it hits the fucking head right every time it's a guarantee Some small mistakes there. That's good. That's what we like to see.
They're waiting for me to move off the high ground. I can smell it. So we gotta figure out what we're gonna do with the Fallen Hero. I mean, we're gonna farm it, but the question is who? There's probably a couple more resurrections left over here. his gear hit squad was very slow this playthrough this attack Love clubs would be nice here too. No. Okay. Uh, we need more daggers over here. A bloody fight. Should let him attack first, I guess. Makes no sense. Why would we let him attack first? All right, let's come down this way. Okay, I would like him to, we would like to kill him on the same round we kill this guy so we don't have to punch through another 100 HP or whatever the hell it is. He might even be more than 100 HP. A new subscriber arrives. It fills you with determination. He isn't gone yet, let's let him go. Hopefully that just kills, nice. Thank you, Ultra Luminal. Appreciate the uh, sub. Would have been nice if someone hit there. Got there. Got a fallen hero and a neck rope. Picked up some 240 plate out of it and a helm. It's pretty good. Armor attachments, whatever. Uh, a bunch of helms that are upgrades. It's kind of nice. Yeah. All right. High shy leveled. And our armor is toast again, or our tools are toast again. We really don't want to take fights for a little bit here. It was a pretty expensive fight in terms of armor. So. Yes, the VOD channel is now a thing. No, no famed item, but another 10% or 12% are at it. It's pretty good. Have to buy tools. It'd really be nice if there wasn't like an absurd price on this right now. It's an absurd price. There's a poacher here too, though. It's good for us. Jesus, man. Can we get a tool price that isn't 300 plus on this? And it's fight and unhold to reduce the cost of that? It doesn't seem very reasonable. 
All right, we're going to buy one. We're going to take the poacher as well. Uh, we're not taking that poacher, though. So that's easily done. I guess we're going to have to head up to a citadel. I didn't really want to do that. Uh, citadel northeast of us. It's one northwest, I think. Are these both just towns? Just towns. Where are the other citadels in this map? South, right? It's one over here. And one over there. All right, we got to get tools. We have um, a little bit of disposable income too. So let's run up north. There's a chance of a person, chance of a good backup. Four times speed mod kills me sometimes. I know, I know. Nice not to lose anyone here. Yes, it's not without its uh, downsides. The <laughs> four times speed mod. There's no way taking this fight makes any sense for us for any reason whatsoever. hoping this isn't a thing. So the problem, of course, is the is cell sword right now. I left open positions for everybody. Or open movement anyways. Occasionally I do horrible things like pass with zero AP left on my brothers in a fight where that's not necessary and then I lose track of who hasn't moved all the way. Yeah, they're just going to stand and throw. We're just going to walk from here. I think that is the last of their guys who catches us. 13. 2, 4, 6, 8. 2, 4, 6, 8. I think we're good. I think it's kill the dog and run. Yeah, I guess if they move towards us in adrenaline, they can catch us next turn. No tools, armor at half, no value in this fight. Just walking away is what you want to do here. Okay.
I wonder how the AI responds to uh, your retreat command. Does it mean does it make them aggressively use adrenaline, or never use adrenaline? Oh, see, we just lost the guy. <laughs> wow, I was really lucky he missed. This is why you can't like you can't. Anyways, this is why it's so hard to allow to use the retreat command because it's like, oh, middle of that, they've moved it on top of me somewhere because the turn the torn order has changed from a from fatigue, I guess. I'm not entirely certain why that happened as it did. So we don't want to take that fight clearly. What was the hit roll? I missed it. Alright, uh, Noble Houses would be nice. We've got to be really close after those two camps, right? 10.50 for Noble Houses, we're 10.09. Okay. 39 to hit, good. Okay. It's a bastard here. Sell sword, another bastard. We're here for tools, or we're here for people too a little bit. They only have... It's a Citadel. Why is there only one tool pack? Fuck. So I'm kind of half selling. It's at 17. 17 is actually not a bad sell price for us. Get rid of some of this garbage, I guess. Our sharp dagger is nice. Tools have been so rare on this map. I mean, my, I've been kind of working with the anything under uh, 250 I'll buy right now, but I think I might have to. I might have to just up that, right? It might have to be like anything under 300 I buy all of them. Cause it's so rare to find them right now. Uh, how does it work for bastards? Presumably they are not lowborn. I don't know if they're nobles though. They're probably just the other ones. They probably have to be dumb. So do we have any with weird names? Nope. All right. So we probably don't want to recruit here. There's no archers. Save the money. I don't know what we're looking for. But I guess it makes sense to check. Which is even good. 40 to 60, 44 to 66, 25, 90, 25, 90, fatigue three less. Nope. Good, I don't have to feel bad about not, not being able to afford that. That's nice. Do we want to mass buy dogs? We'll swarm the unhold with dogs. I guess I should buy one dog. Not even good price here. 342 is all right. All right, I'll buy one dog. All right, we got to find somewhere to buy tools. That has to happen. Can probably handle a small orc camp now. Tools in an orc camp. Let's head down this way. Let's try to dodge any more barbarians. I won't be able to move at four speed. How in tool debt are we? Yeah, we're still 54 tools in debt right now. Thralls would be fine, although I'm not going to go out of my way to fight them. Quitters 
never win. I think I'm vicariously addicted to Battle Brothers from watching you. Thank you, G.I. Joe, for the resub. I'm glad to hear that. It's a positive thing, I think. All right, so all my brothers are at, like, half health. Good, good. Jesus, they are like all like half health or less. This is orc one shot range is what I'm getting at. weapons for orcs particularly. I don't have amazing weapons for orcs here at all. Make sure we're using our arming sword. Guess spear. How many orcs is it? Four to six orc young. There's an argument for actual just pure shield wall here. I think we actually will go with that argument. I don't like pure shield wall very often, but this is one of the places where it's okay. We're likely to be taking multiple hits. And our back rank damage is what will carry us through the fight. So we'll walk into that with that plan. Take it before nightfall. Yeah. I haven't updated uh, any of those mods. So if you guys, uh, uh, YOEN, Jarek, if you guys are working on cool things like name mods for like donkeys and like weapons and stuff like that, and you need updates for that, just ping me on Discord. Uh, and I'll try to do it in between streams to update those for cool stuff like that. But I just uh, I haven't even been looking. I mean, I look for pings on Discord, of course, but I mean, I don't know. Uh, haven't been looking to see if those have been upgraded or not. I don't think we're moving. All those bleeds for nothing. It's going well. <laughs> Fucking javelins. All right. Some amber and eight tools. Oh. 
Renown should be pretty close. 10 to 17, sure. Fingers crossed for tools that don't cost over 300. They've been jumped by enormous yetis. And there's a deer nearby. 329 tools. But food's dirt cheap. Uh, two brothers we're interested in. What's the mission? Caravan two days to the west of Alton Forth. Let's see where it is. What are we? Day 35 is the cooldown off the cultist event. Alton Forth is where we were. I think I gotta get some tools heading south. So I think I have to make it at least to windfall. So I think no on this. We're going to buy 300 price tools. I would love to roll on these poachers as well, but I'm a bit concerned that when the next event triggers, we're just going to lose all of our brothers. Sully level up. Level 100. Sure. All right, we're gonna leave the poachers for now. It's like against everything I believe in, in Battle Brothers, but uh. All right, brigands times thirteen, brigand times nine, poachers and thugs. It's an easy kill. I'm not sure we actually gain tools or value out of it, but it would be quick. This is poachers and thugs again. Do either of these count for anything? Not gonna gain renown out of it. We will gain a little bit of experience. Might make our brothers all super dark green. I'm kind of curious if you're super dark green, if uh, in good spirits, if you're gonna lose brothers or not. I don't really want to engage into two to three poachers. Feels like such limited value. I think I walk past it. It's experience, but it's not particularly exciting experience. Let's hope for something good down here. Uh, we'll hire any cultists right now. Beasts. Probably taking this. Let's look at the other contract. Got another poacher here. Unless I wonder if it's a uh, ironic quick tools at 418. All right, we're gonna run down what terrorizes and see if we get anywhere out of it. Hopefully, it's not a ridiculous number of dire wolves. How's the brother? He's asthmatic. Sure, they sacrifices to Davko would cure asthmatic. That seems useful to me. So, pretty bad. 54 0. Missed everything there. 49 HP is pretty bad. I don't think there's anything. I don't think there's any redeeming feature about this brother. I think it's goodbye. Even though he's a cultist. Okay. All right, let's take the mission. Direwolves in a swamp would be unacceptable. His direwolves, I'm sure. Take that camp in a minute. 12? 12 direwolves? That's not reasonable. That's so fucking many, man. That's so unreasonable. Uh, all right, can we handle 12 dire wolves? Maybe? This culty really rarely has anything to do with what you actually see spawn. It's almost always the dollar value.
fucking absurd number of them. Not like our weapons are exciting versus them either. My initiative one. I have somebody's an initiative one, right? Early cultists, initial cultists. 87 initiative. Alright. No, shoulder guard armor uh, armor's being reserved for one of the undead pieces. I don't think fighting this in a swamp helps us. I don't think fighting on elevation helps us. I think we want to fight like right here. Should have pulled it into that fucking camp is what I should have done. I think they just attacked us from elevation. 